Well, Cheru, I don't exactly know how to tell you this, mate, but I think this might be your life now. I think you might be a knight that's completely down and out on his luck. You've lost everything you ever had. Your home, your job, your family. You don't have a cent to your name anymore, but you're lucky. Because the owner of this beautiful establishment told you that you can stay here for as long as it takes you to get back on your feet completely free. All you need to do for him is sweep the place up on your hands and knees every afternoon while you're completely naked. He even gave you a bloody apple because an apple a day keeps keeps the uh, AIDS away. What? And a banana because when you're really, really bored and you've got no money, a banana a day provides hours and hours and hours of play. He also said something a little bit strange about there being an, a zombie infestation in the town lately and that sometimes late at night zombies wander through the front door of the tavern looking to mess the place up, but whatever happens, he told me if they turn up I've got to make sure that they don't damage this place. None of the pots, none of the chairs, and most importantly, none of the frickin' booze, because we all know that a bar is nothing. <laughs> Oh, shit. Oh, hey, it looks like we might have our first guest for the night. I, where, where the front door's open. Where the hell did you come from? Did you jump down the chimney? This guy is already sh** faced. Look, I can't serve you. I, we've got a policy right here. We don't serve people when they're- Bruh. Listen, mate, look, I don't- I, I really- I don't want any trouble. I- I just- <laughs> I don't want any trouble. You're drunk and you're acting crazy. I know you don't know what you're doing right now, but what you're doing is out of control. You broke the pot. You've- you Alright, mate, you see these hands? You see see these hands? These are the hands of a freaking killer. Yes, they're very small. Yeah, they're, they're child hands. I don't know why my hands are so small. I'm angry now. You guys are just coming in here and you're destroying everything. You know what? You're gonna break everything. You're gonna do it on my turn, son of a bitch. I really think we need to... You just broke my chair. I want you to take a seat on here. We're gonna have a Dr. Phil moment right now, okay? Sit down on the chair. Or just fall in the fireplace. You know, that works too. Hold on a second. I'm gonna try and yeet you back into the fireplace. Are you ready? Three, two, one, yeet! Oh, crap. Okay, you know what? Ugh. I think I'll just eat your beating heart instead. Oof. Dude, you're so drunk. Just look here. Have this apple. Oh, come on. Okay, okay. How about a banana? Oh, you broke the banana too. All right, I'm freaking pissed now. And you're just. Oh, you just broke another pot, you son of a. The only way I see us dealing with this problem, Barry, is removing those arms so you don't cause any more mischief. You know what? Remove one of those legs first. Sorry, I know this is this is a little bit extreme. All right, that's it. That's it. I've I've had enough. I've had it. I've had enough. I've tried everything. I gave you a banana. I gave you an apple. I even gave you ah. Oh, Fricks. I even gave you a bottle of my finest whiskey and you just keep smashing the place up and disrespecting me. This isn't even my cabin. You know what? I'm gonna destroy everything. So I've got an alibi as to why I murdered your ass. And then we're gonna get down to business. What's that? You think you think you think I'm out of my mind? You think I'm a crazy man? Well, you chose the wrong freaking crazy man to mess with. I'm clinically insane. I'm out of my freaking mind and you chose the wrong person in the wrong night. Let's get down to business. <sighs> oh, Jesus Christ, Barry, you're back from the dead again. Freaking hell, I'm getting sick of having to lob your goddamn head off every single time. You know, you're you're not welcome here for the first and last time. Piss off, mate. Jeez. <laughs> How much damage are you going to cause when you've got no freaking leg? Let's see you cause some damage now. What are you going to do? Oh, you're, you're dead. Barry, please kindly uh, go back up the chimney that you came down. It didn't need to end like this, buddy. It, re it really didn't need to end like this. You just... You pushed me too far. Listen, Barry, it's time for an intervention, okay? I, I want you to have a look at Larry right here. Look at Larry. This is what happens to people when they do too much cocaine. Look at his nose. Or where his nose used to be. He doesn't even have a goddamn nose anymore. I could put your nose inside of his nose hole. Look at that. Isn't that f***ed up? That's what's gonna happen to you if you don't get off the cocaine, alright? Or, this could just happen to both of you. Okay, you're already dead, never mind, I'm just gonna eat his heart. Oh, you're still alive? Wait, wait, no, I thought you were dead. Larry, I mean Barry, I thought you were- oh. Definitely dead now. Yeah, have this. Oh, god damn, I dropped the heart on the floor. Five second rule, come here. Eat this. It's freaking gone, it rolled under the bag of wheat. All right, Barry, what happens if I grab one wrist and then I grab your head and I try and uh, separate the two from each other? It seems like Barry's soul is trying to separate itself from his body. Let me help you with that, Barry. <sighs> All right, now it's sword fighting time. Oh, bet you didn't expect that little bit of a- Oh, what's, what's happened? What's happened? Oh. <laughs> well, I guess it's time for me to leave the tavern and see where destiny takes me.
onwards and all of that. Crikey, what the bloody hell am I doing in this place? It's freaking freezing, I swear to God. I've got to be the dumbest knight in the entire realm. Who goes into the middle of the snow wearing plate armor? It's like dressing yourself in a freaking refrigerator. And honestly, I was just trying to find my way to the next tavern so I could get pissed all over again and lop off another couple of heads. Now, here I am in the middle of nowhere at some ancient ruins. I think I'm having a spiritual encounter. I think the statue's talking to me. This is your conscience, Cheru. You must kill more people so you feel better about your pathetic existence. Do it now, my son. Amen. Well, I, I guess I'd better murder some people so I can feel better about my miserable existence. Well, I was looking for an opportunity to put these things to the test. Try and hit me. Come on. Try and get back up, buddy. Come on. Come on. Up. I told you to get up. We want blood. We want blood. Stay back. Stay back. I don't... I don't- this life of killing is not- it's not for- freaking son of a- Ugh. I tried to say that this life of killing was not for me, but you guys are not making it easy for me to turn a new leaf. You're making it very, very, very difficult. I'm sick of this, Larry. I'm freaking- Ugh. Oh, shite. Sorry, I'm feeling a little bit peckish. Oh my god, aren't you the guy from Dark Souls? You know, like, praise the sun. You're you're a freaking meme at this point, man. I freaking love you, dude. I freaking... Piss off. I'm a freaking massive fan, bro. I'm still gonna kill you, but I still think you're... It's This makes it even more exciting. At least, for a change, I know who I'm killing. That's really cool. Come here. Wait, wait, wait. Wait for it. Wait, 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 wait. Keep still. Hold on. That's what you look like? You're an ugly son of a bitch. Oh, this is terrible. We definitely have to do something about this. Hold on a second. You wanna do your praise the sun line? You, you wanna do it first? Praise the sun and all that. No? Okay. You're gonna be praising the sun ever again. Bitch! Well, it seems like the further I progress on my mission, the, uh, the more ridiculous the places I visit continue to get. I started off in a tavern, then I ended up in the frozen ruins. And now I'm inside of some dungeon filled with lava, which can only mean wonderful, wonderful things. You know, at this point, I honestly have no idea what my goal or my mission is, so I'm taking it upon myself to ensure that nobody ever crosses this bridge. From this moment forward, this bridge right here belongs to me. And if you think you're crossing the bridge, you've, you've got another thing coming. You're not, you're not crossing my bridge, skeleton. You can try. <laughs> All right, we've got two more brave adventurers that wish to try and cross my bridge. Adventure number one. Okay, that was unexpected. Uh, okay. All right, we're dealing with real professionals right here. More challenges have entered the arena. Come, fight me on my bridge. Or just walk into the trap and get your head knocked off like the previous five guys. This is the brave soul that's gonna make it past the first trap. <laughs> God damn it. Are you the brave soul that's going to make it to- Hold on a second. Wait, 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 wait. Don't come any closer. Just stay right there. I'm- Oh, shite. Wait, wait. Stop, 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 stop. You know what? I can't take this anymore. Goodbye, cruel world. Yay! Bro, stop. Come here, come on, let's go. I'm gonna bring you down here, I'm gonna escort you down here myself. All right, you stay there, give me a second, let me get into the middle of my bridge, and let's do this. Here we go, one for the ages, the the, the challenger that actually made it to the bridge. Where, where are you going? Dude, dude, stop, 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 what, 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 what the f Don't do that, don't, 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 please don't. Don't, no, no, I, I, don't, don't, god damn it. Ah, brave soul, you have made it. You have made it to my bridge. I just are you the chosen? God help me. Look, I'm gonna meet you halfway because I know how things tend to happen around here. Let- Oh, for f sake. You know what? I mean, it's gonna happen anyway. It's- it's- it's inevitable. It seems like you guys are completely incapable of not launching yourselves headfirst into the pit of death below the bridge. So, I'm gonna bring you here and I'm just gonna- I'm gonna drop you down myself. Do you have any final words? Anything you'd like to say? Knock knock. Who's there? You. You who? You dead. Bye bye. Holy crap, I can't believe it. My journey has finally brought me back home. Oh my god, does it feel good to be back. What the f happened to my door? Are you responsible for this? All right, listen, my my, my journey is over. I'm, I'm finished. I'm back home now. That means that all of this crazy shit is finished. The undead hordes finished. No, no more. No this nonsense, okay? No more of this crazy undead business. I'm back home now. It's time for... Are you seriously still... Are you seriously still coming towards me? Back it up. Come on, boys. Come get some of this sexy night action. You don't know what you're messing with. Honestly, you've never seen anything like this. I've traveled. I've been around. I'm not some little 
village boy who lived in a hut his whole life. I've been places. I've seen shit that you wouldn't believe. See that? I just stabbed you through the f***ing knee. All right, Swagger Souls, come on down here, buddy. We're going to give your armor a thorough testing. Make sure that you're battle ready so you don't go out there in the field and have some accidents. We're going to start with the shield. Hold on. Let me give the shield a little bit of a... Oh, frick. A little bit of a whack. Okay, shield's not very good. Let's see if we can test out those shin pads. No, they're not very good either. Jesus Christ. Hold on. What about the... Oh, no. This is some really shitty armor. Yeah, that's not very good. Are you okay? Oh, no, you're good. All right, let's test out the van braces. Let me give you a little bit of a whack on the arm. Keep still. Okay, they're not very good. All right, your arm is just shit all around. It's just really not very good. So, um, look, I don't know what to tell you. There's just, there's not much that can be done at this point, um, except this. Sorry, mate. 